Welcome back. Well, this weekend, a fundraiser is being held to celebrate the lives of Abby Williams and Libby German. It's been more than a year since the two teenagers from Delphi were found murdered. News 18's Kiera Lake reports on the progress of a park being built in their honor and how people can help move the construction process along. Nothing's bringing the girls back. Uh, so we have memories, and that's what we have, and that's what we're going to keep going with. Teenagers Abby Williams and Libby German were found murdered in February of 2017. This was a loss for their families and the community, says German's grandfather, Mike Patty. Saturday, the public is invited to come together for the second annual Abby and Libby celebration of life. There will be games, raffle prizes, and food, and the money raised goes towards the construction of the Abby and Libby Memorial Park in Delphi. We've already got the land all acquisition. We've got permits. We've got prints in place. And part of the driveway is laid out, which you can see by the intersection of Hoosier Heartland and 218. It's, <laughs> it's slow, I'll be honest with you. Patty says it's hard to set a timeline for this $1 million project. Work is in the heavy construction phase, which includes larger equipment like bulldozers. And everything relies heavily on fundraising and donated equipment, resources, and time from construction crews. We're going to get there. You know, it's going to take a lot longer than what, what we all want, but uh, just perseverance, we'll stay after it till it's done. But even as the final touches wrap up on Memorial Park, whenever that is, Patty will continue to share his granddaughter's story. The person responsible for this is still walking around. We haven't made an arrest yet. We don't have him. And I'm going to continue to do everything, you know, our families are going to continue to do everything we can until we get this guy caught. Kiera Lake, News 18. The Abby and Libby Celebration of Life is tomorrow at the Delphi High School football field. It's being held from 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. Admission is $2 per person. The Salvation Army and